tell you a little story. Mm. Um, I came to Aizol 24 years ago. And I met a little boy called Ruben. He was six years old. And time passed and he came to England and he stayed in my home. And he went to school and in time he joined the British Army. And everything he did well. And he deserves his beautiful bride today. Mm. And we are the witnesses to their shared love. And one of the ways you are joining in and showing your love is by taking photographs. Oh. <laughs> With your phones. <laughs> All the time. <laughs> but God does not have an iPhone. God looks straight into the human heart. And he sees the love of a man and a woman and he blesses that love. And he blesses that love because it is part of his creation. And God loves everything that he has created. And he will show that at Christmas when he sends his son to live with us. To share in our joys and in our sorrows. But at a wedding, the primary emotion is joy. It is sheer joy in life itself. The joy of a life shared together. The joy of a life shared among all of us with God. And our God keeps his promises. Just as Reuben and Shwe with her with God's good grace will keep their promises. We must keep our promise. And our promise is to love and support this couple whatever happens. So I suggest to you that when we take all our photographs, we are photo 
photographing the joy of life. Not just the beautiful military uniforms. Very handsome though they are. So Ruben and Shrey, may God bless you. May the Lord bless you and keep you and lift up the light of his face upon you and give you his joy and his peace this day and forevermore. Amen. Amen. It is such a privilege to be a guest at a wedding. Thank you so much for inviting us all. Kalome. Happy birthday, cake and each. Merry Christmas, Dean and Don Penny. Happy One of my father's side, she is the only one who survived right now. So my aunt, there, one of them, yeah. So so good pen round it can
ตัวเราต้องติดการเขียนไปตัวนั้นไว้เนี่ยเห็นเดียวนะมีตัวเรื่องเขียนอะไรนี่มาเจอแล้วป่าตั้งอยู่ในคงไอ้นั่นเองจ